All right, so people who have been anxiously waiting for the iOS 18 update to come to their iPhones, well, the wait is over because Apple has officially announced that it's releasing iOS 18 for everyone. And here's a video on what you should look out for and what you should do before downloading the latest iOS 18. So let's go. First up, yes, the date is here. 16th of September is when Apple said that we'll be getting you the latest iOS 18 for everyone. So uh, no caveats, no stipulations, just download it. But how you can do that is just follow these simple steps. Now, first up, go to your iPhone setting and then tap on general. Over there, you will see software update and then tap on that. Now, if your phone is showing the update latest iOS 18, then tap on that and the update will start downloading. Now, expect this update to be large in size, approximately more than one GB. So make sure that you free up a little space before you decide to go ahead with the update. Now, hang on, very important and make sure that you follow these instructions because updating the iPhone might cause a few bugs and errors in your device. So before you update, make sure you back up all of your data. Now, in order for you to back up your iPhone's data, just simple go to your phone setting. Over there, you will see your name, tap on that name and then go to iCloud. Now, within the iCloud option, you will see an option to back up data, which says backup. Now, just tap on that and make sure all your messages, contacts and everything, photos, applications are backed up so that even if your iPhone encounters some kind of a bug or error, your data is at least safe. Now, just a reminder for everyone that it's not necessary for you to update to the latest iOS 18. Apple is allowing you to stay on the Apple 17.7 update. So if you don't feel that you need to change anything around and you're comfortable with the current firmware, then no need to update. However, it is always advised that you update to the latest firmware because of security patches and all of the latest uh, in software that Apple is releasing will come to your iPhone. So advise, but if you don't want to change, stay there. Now the update downloading and also the installation will take some time so you'll have to wait a couple of minutes however when the installation is done your device will heat up a little so give it time to breathe don't just start using the phone immediately because the indexing of the software inside the phone needs to happen so give it a little time to breathe and then start using the device because yes it's going to be a bit hot the update kind of does that to a phone now as per reports online it has been observed that the latest ios 18 in terms of battery life does take up a lot of the battery juice compared to the previous iteration so expect in terms of the battery to be affected because that is something that people have observed online and I'm sure that Apple will develop a fix and release it very soon but immediately do not worry at all. Now another disclaimer that people were expecting to use some of the latest Apple intelligence features well they are not coming with the iOS 18 update. Apple has confirmed that all of the Apple intelligence features that will be coming to the 15 Pro, 15 Pro Max and the 16 series will come in October. So while you will get all of the uh, iOS 18 features on the iPhone, the Apple intelligence features will come with the 18.1 update that will be released in October. Now, with this new update, you can expect a few customizations in the control center and also the way your homepage looks. You can expect a few AI features in terms of transcriptions, haptics, and the way and the ability to control your iPhone with your eyes. So some of these features are coming with the latest iOS 18. To know all of the features, you can have a look at this video that we have done on some of the developer updates that we use and experience. So basic, all of the 18 features are going to be similar. So have a look at that video in order for you to understand what all iOS 18 offers. So that was a video on the iOS 18 and how you can update your iPhones to the latest firmware. Remember, all of the iPhones that were running on iOS 17 are compatible and will get the iOS iOS 18. You will be able to see the downloads very soon. If you're not, just be a little patient because Apple has said it's officially out and you can definitely download it. Watch this video. Please share it with everyone who has an iPhone and enjoy the iOS 18 features. We'll be back with more tech right here on Fiverr.